hello in this video i will explain you what is the rank of the matrix and how can you calculate the rank of any type of matrix suppose uh, this uh, here is example a is a matrix uh, element of uh, this matrix is uh, this in uh, you want to calculate the rank of the rank of this matrix first of all i will explain you what is the rank i mean so um, what is the meaning of the rank so rank first uh, you should know what is a minor minor is a minor of any matrix is uh, obtained by deleting any rows and columns means uh, suppose i want to remove this uh, row and one column whatever elements remaining is the minor so first of all you choose uh, r into r type of my minor means uh, it should be a square minor a square type of minor means uh, it should be either 3 into 3 it should be 4 into 4 or something like that it should be a square type of matrix which is formed by deleting uh, rows and columns and which should element of uh, this uh, minor it should be taken from the original matrix and uh, start uh, r by choosing maximum how much uh, maximum you can take the r here in this example this is 4 by 3 type of matrix so i can choose a uh, maximum r value should be r r max is how much 3 it is a uh, limited to 3 so i can take only 3 into 3 type of matrix from this matrix so r maximum is 3 so there is a uh, a various combination of uh, this uh, 3 into 3 type of matrix by choosing um, row as, and columns but the limiting limitation is that uh, uh, column will be fixed only row can uh, vary if i remove the first row i can take this uh, three row or if i remove this row i can take first second first third and fourth row so in this way i can um choose the minors so the first step is to choose the r into r type of minor from the matrix and uh, and the second stage is to calculate the determinant value suppose uh, the first uh, i want to first uh, minor of this matrix is uh, by uh, removing this uh, row the first is, is a1 a2 a3 b1 b2 b3 and c1 c2 c3 this is the first matrix um, the other matrix can be obtained by by removing the first row and uh, taking uh, rest rest to three row so here is a three by three type of matrix so all type here is possibility of uh, taking all type of matrix so find out the determinant values of uh, each type if you get all the values of the de all the determinant value is zero if suppose all the determinant is zero then rank is not r so you have to choose now r minus r minus one into r minus one type of uh, minors and in the similar way find out the determinant of all the possible combination of the matrix if uh, any one of the determinant value is uh, uh, not zero then the rank will be r minus one or r minus two similarly suppose uh, here the second uh, in uh, r r into r type suppose the determinant is zero means the uh, first determinant is zero first determinant is not zero then the rank will be r so condition is that so what is what is the meaning of rank rank is largest largest order rank is equal to largest order of none 
vanishing minor means the largest order first here the maximum um, the meaning of this is largest order of non vanishing minor here the first uh, maximum possible of minor is maximum order of the minor is r if any of the r type of matrix means minor determinant is not zero non vanishing then it uh, the value the order this order will becomes the rank so if all value is zero then go for next so this is the meaning of the rank next i will give you example now the problem is uh, how to calculate the rank suppose uh, this is a matrix a and you want to find you want to calculate the rank of this matrix how can you calculate the general way means uh, the actual way is to get, find out the determinant values for uh, this 3 by 3 type of matrix and uh, if uh, it is a uh, determinant value is not zero then rank will be 3 if uh, the determinant value is zero then go for 2 by 2 type of matrix from the selected row and selected column called minors if uh, it will be non zero for any type of 2 by 2 type then uh, rank will be 2 so it will be a very tedious process the easy way to find out the rank is easy way to transform elementary transformation elementary transformation means um, what is the meaning of this even if you elementary transform means suppose uh, r2 minus uh, twice r1 or sub, uh, like this example if you want to uh, element to transform r2 to r2 minus r1 or or c3 minus c3 change the c3 to c3 plus uh, twice c2 or something like that even if you do this uh, the matrix will be called equivalent matrix and rank will be same so find out uh, that type of matrix so uh, find out uh, transform the row and column in such a way that you will get the zeros number of zeros should be more so that you can uh, find out the determinant value easily if you uh, if you have a number of zero if you have more number of zeros then it will be easy for you to find out the determinant value so this is the process to calculate the rank trans to calculate the rank you just transform row and column in such a way that you will get um, more zeros in the matrix here is the example suppose a is a matrix of 3 into 4 type means number of row is 3 and number of column is 4 you are required to find out the rank so to find out the rank the easy uh, way is to transform the element transform the element uh, in such a way that uh, you will get maximum number of 0 so uh, what uh, will you do this the first step is here you see 1 and 1 so you just uh, make it zero by subtracting this row so in r1 do following r1 minus r2 you will get 1 minus 5 plus 5 and 0 2 minus 1 is 1 minus 1 minus 4 is 5 and similar <coughs> and to get more number of zero suppose i want to, to transfer this element to zero what will you do add the second column to the third column so c3 do the following task c3 plus c2 so you will get this so you will get two numbers of zero here i i want to make more number of zero so in c2 this is the c2 i want to make this element zero so how can you get this multiply this column by five and add it to c2 so here i have done this multiplied with 5 and uh, add it, added it to c2 the c2 will be like this so i want further 0 here 2 1 6 3 so i want to make uh, this to 0 by <coughs> multiplying this column with 2 and subtracting this with this so c3 minus 2 c4 here it will become 0 i want to make this uh, also zero what i need to do is multiply 
the fourth column with 9 and subtract it from C2. So I will get this. So what I see here is 2 column with 0. So suppose I want to find out the rank of the matrix original A and uh, these are the equivalent uh, matrix of A. So rank of all the equivalent matrix is the same as A. So rank of A is also equal to rank of this element, this uh, matrix. So if I want to try to find out the rank of this matrix, it will be easy because um, I first I try to select uh, 4 by 4. I cannot select 4 4 into 4 type of matrix because number of column number of row is limited to 3. So I I can start only from 3 into 3 type of uh, matrix. So if I take the combination of 3 by 3 type is 3 type there will be 4, ty four uh, type of uh, minor matrix will be formed but in all the 4 there will be there will be one th this and this one column uh, will must be present in all these 4 matrix so if one column is totally is 0 then determinant value is also 0 so all the 4 determinant is equal to 0 so 3 by 3 rank is not 3 because for 3 by 3 type of minor all type of minor is 0 so to find out the rank you have to go for further down so next is 2 into 2 select 2 row and 2 column I am selecting this first row and second row first column and second column so the matrix will be like 1 0 5 3 find out the determinant of this the determinant value is 3 minus 0 is equal to 3 which is not equal to 0 so there is minimum so I get one uh, 2 by 2 type of matrix of which determinant value is not 0 so rank is 2 because higher than 2 3 into 3 I, I have got all the determinant is 0 but at the level of 2 2 into 2 type of determinant I have got non zero values of the determinant so rank is 2 because rank of this element this matrix is 2 which is similar to this matrix so rank of this A is also 2 rank of A is 2